the Coach Lori handbag. Is it worth it? Hello everyone, welcome back to another mommy review. I review all things for the love of. Today I'm doing a handbag review of the Coach Lori handbag. Now before I get started, if you like the content on this channel, please consider giving this video a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you so much for considering and on with the video. So today I am heading over to Coach to check out the Lori handbag. This is a handbag that I've been looking at back in December and it's caught my eye because it's again like available right now and it's on sale. So I thought I'll bring you over to the store with me. So this is the Coach Lori handbag. They actually have several colors available in the store. This is the black version as you can see here. It has a zipper that runs down the middle as a middle center compartment and then also outer zipper on the outside as well. It's made out of pebble leather and the dimensions of the handbag is roughly 12 and a quarter inch in length, 10 and a quarter inch in height and is six inches in width. Just find that this is like a really great handy handbag. It's made out of soft pebble leather and also has like a snap pocket on the inside. The strap, as you can see, is adjustable to an 11 inch drop. So I love how like Coach thought about the little details of even like the shoulder strap of having it adjustable because a lot of handbag brands don't have that option available. I typically prefer a crossbody, just let me go hands free, but somehow this handbag just caught my eye. I think it looks really great for the fall for the colors that are on sale right now. There's plenty of room and like really easy to carry. As you look inside, there's already compartments built in for like a busy lifestyle. It looks pretty simple on the outside, but I guess simplicity is bliss, right? So there's a center compartment as you can see. This handbag has sway interior and I think it's like a great handbag for going on a night out or going to work or like playground or just pub with friends and extra thing they have with the feet on the bottom of the handbag I thought was really nice the handbag really holds quite a bit which I think is a major pro related to this particular handbag you can see the inside has a zipper compartment down the middle with two large pockets on either side that has a magnetic closure again here's the adjustable strap I like how the strap you can make it a little bit longer just there's a lot of additional notches available for you to make it the right length for you because we're not all built the same and the handbag's like not too big not too small with lots of pockets and the compartments I think just fits everything the leather is very supple and soft and I love that about the handbag there's so much room for all the little things and when you're trying out the handbag at the store, I love to try out the weight of the handbag and make sure to take that like pillow that they use for stuffing inside because they actually have some kind of weight in it as well. And I felt that this handbag wasn't super heavy in weight when it was empty, which is like a really great thing. Because I would hate for a handbag to be like super heavy even without anything in it and just kind of kills my shoulder for the whole day. I do find that the strap is a little bit thinner than the usual straps I'm used to for shoulder bags so that's something I'm just cautious about. Here is another color of the handbag. You can see that there's actually different material compared to the pebble leather that you see on the front and you can see the interior of the handbag also has like different color schemes depending on which one you purchase. This one has gold hardware that go with the handbag versus the black one it actually comes in two different versions of hardware. There is a gold one and also like the black on black. But I think that this version is really great for the winter time where it's like a black one is a little bit more timeless I would say. I think overall like it's a very elegant shoulder bag just due to its simplicity and like utility of it. I honestly don't really care for the bling or like the extra hardware. For me, it's all about the functionality at this point. It's a great handbag to kind of run for errands and even dress up for dinner. Looks pretty classy, I would say, and very elegant. I would say if you find that this bag is too small and you want to put more things in it, I will probably size up to a tote instead of trying to find and make this handbag work. I think it's a great designer handbag if you're planning on kind of going from a mommy like backpack and this is kind of a Nick size 
down if you're thinking of sizing down from your mommy purse so i just want to show you the different variations that they have in the store because a lot of times what you see in the store can look very different from what you see on the website and this is the white one as well the chalk color which i absolutely love i think it's so great for like summer and the work world for winter there's a magnetic closure that you can see now onto some like potential cons related to this handbag a lot of it is just based on like experience by other people who also have this bag for a while so number one i've been hearing some quality issues like the black siding peeling for the strap and i know that some people who have the version that is like the snake skin trimming it actually peels in multiple areas and shows the white cord underneath which is a little disappointing to hear about some quality issues Number two, I heard things about the burgundy lining actually bleeding. So have to watch out for that as well because you hate to ruin like other wallets and like cases that you would put in your handbag. Here on the website, you can see the bag is currently priced at $275 for this pine green version, which unfortunately I wasn't able to get a hold of. And this is actually one that I was really drawn towards because I really love the color green and I thought it would be nice to have something a little bit different from the typical black. As you can see, there's like compartments, let's say I described, built in, two magnetic ones on the side, and then a center zip compartment. Here's how it looks like on the model. As I was talking about cons, number three, I should mention that the buckle for the adjustable shoulder strap, there's been mentioned about how it will catch on fabric when your bag is off your shoulder. So that's something to be like cautious about. And then I've heard mix comments about the zipper being a little bit stiff but i feel like it's something that will probably happen initially with a new bag and you can probably wax a little bit so it should not be a big deal i know that some people also comment on how it doesn't really have a closure for the purse i mean there is the snap magnetic closure but like if you have any items that you worry about security issues there is only the center zipper compartment that you need to be able to put your kind of like more high alert things in and again i mentioned about the straps being a little bit thinner than i usually see for shoulder bags so i'm really worried about it cutting into your shoulder especially if you have more items in the handbag but overall i do feel like the handbag is looks very classy very elegant not logo heavy and i really like that and again the comments i'm hearing about quality issues with handbags i think it's like with select styles of the handbag uh, with certain like linings and certain like snakeskin trims so i don't think it applies for all handbags i still find that it's a very functional handbag with not a lot of extra bells and whistles and definitely one to consider if you're thinking of downsizing from a mommy purse well that's it for today thank you so much for joining me on this mommy review of the lori handbag from coach now i'd love to hear from you what do you think about this handbag is this something that you think you would love or you would leave and also if you have experience with the handbag i would love to hear what your thoughts were on it personally this is one that i've been watching out at coach for a while so i'm considering jumping the gun on it one of the things I really like about the handbag is that it's not super deep. So despite its good capacity, you can still easily find your items without like having a hard time searching for it within the handbag. So I think it's like a great classy option for mommies out there. So that's it for today for this mommy review. Thank you so much for joining me and hopefully I'll see you next time in another mommy review. Take care and stay safe everyone. Bye for now.